I have a friend who's a pastor, and uh, his name is Brian, and he, he, he went through a depression, and so he was talking to me about uh, the time he spent with his counselor, and his counselor had him do this curious exercise. He said, Brian, I want you to imagine that there are, okay, there are two empty chairs here, right? And I want you to imagine that seated in the chairs are two versions of yourself, all right? Over here is your ideal Brian, the golden boy Brian, all right? Everything that you, the best that you have it in you to be, right? Okay? Over here is your less than ideal Brian, the prodigal Brian, all right? And I would like, I wonder what you'd have to say to these two Brians. And Brian thought, oh, this is a little weird, but I'm paying him, so he goes for it. And uh, so he begins addressing this Brian and says the things he appreciates about himself, you know, saying, uh, you know, that he's a pastor, a leader in the community, a good um, husband and father and all these things. Then it comes time for him to deal, to address the less than perfect Brian. And all of a sudden, this rage came up in him, and he began to spew accusations and shame and unload it all on this Brian, so angry with him. Because this Brian is always messing it up for this Brian. <laughs> Life would be great if it weren't for this Brian, right? And he's just going, you know? And all of a sudden, he, he has a moment. I believe the Holy Spirit convicted him. And all of a sudden, his heart broke for this Brian. And he realized, man, all this Brian wants in the whole world is to be this Brian. And he keeps trying so hard. And every time he blows it, he gets accused and shamed and beat up for it. He gets kicked when he's down. And so the real Brian, I know this is like an algebra equation here, but <laughs> the real Brian gets convicted and that he needs to apologize and ask forgiveness <laughs> from this Brian. And he also realizes that, that really this is more like the real Brian, you know? Uh, and this is the Brian who's got a testimony and a story to tell, right? And by the way, this is the Brian that Jesus died for. This is the Brian that Jesus loves. Jesus didn't come to die for the golden boy, Brian. I suspect most, if not all of us in this room, harbor a lot of shame and self-hatred. I know that I do. I hate myself. Which, in essence, means I hate the one that Jesus loves. We're so hard on the one that Jesus loves, you know? And I wonder how that makes him feel. You know? When people talk poorly of my children, I care about that, you know? I wonder if it breaks his heart how hard we are on the one that Jesus loves, you know? So, maybe we could just learn to not hate ourselves so much. And if that's too hard for us, maybe we can borrow from the heart of Jesus and be a little kinder to the one that Jesus loves, you know? So this is a song I wrote about it. All two sides to every person Like the two sides of a dime Heads and tails, it depends upon Who's watching at the time Though I hate to say it Mine is no exception One part is the prodigal The other part deception mm -hmm. Like the prince and the pauper like Jacob and his brother, each hide a different heart, each the shadow of the other. Me and my doppelganger both share the same blood. The one I have hated, the other held I loved. One of them's the golden boy, the man I'd like to be. I show him off in the parades for all the world to see The other is much weaker, he stumbles all the time The source of my embarrassment 
He's the one I try to hide Oh, oh, oh Whoa, 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 whoa. The golden boy is made of straw His finest suit will surely burn His vice is the virtue that he never had to earn The prodigal's been broken and emptied at the wishing well But he's stronger for the breaking with a story to tell mm. I'm not easy with confession It's hard to tell the truth But I favor the golden boy While the other I've abused He takes it like a man Though he's longing like a child To be loved and forgiven And share the burden for a while Good look in the mirror Can you tell me who you see? The one that Jesus died for Or the one you'd rather be? Can you find it in your heart To have mercy on the one The Father loved so much That he gave his only son Thank you.